we're at Victoria's, which is normally called the home style restaurant, but that now that they have a actual sit down, kind of uh, for drinks, wine, beer, milkshakes, iced tea. And a table service. Go. Yeah, table service. So you just sit down, they bring the menu. Um, we went ahead and tried a milkshake, a banana milkshake. They have quite a few different ones, even alcoholic ones, so if you want. We got the banana milkshake Olaf, which is super cute. And then the um, tea mint. I was thinking what else it's called. Green tea mint, which looks fresh. And then we got a plate of uh, three patisserie, and you could choose three or six, I think, right? Yeah. And ours is, a, we got a lemon tart, a mint tart, cake, and a chocolate cake. So I'm curious, it looks really good. And um, just so you know, the milkshakes are about 10, and then alcohol a little more. And the tea was five euros, and the little plate is six euros. And I, the other one I think was maybe just a few more euros if you want more, so yeah. I'm curious what it's gonna be like. But it's a really nice setting, and you can see the castle in the distance. And yeah, I'm gonna take a sip of my tea here. Oh, it's really light. I was worried because they said it came with, well, cane sugar, and I was like, usually it's quite uh, sweet, but this is nice. It's light, um, just a hint of sweetness, and the mint is fresh mint, which is a good thing. Uh, I would recommend it. Now, honey, you have to go try your uh, milkshake. Right, honey. So there we go. So this is the banana milkshake. Um, and while well, Oliver's Oliver's no longer liking the summer, I guess, because he's melting. So he's he's, really, he's turning into a puddle at the he's moment. Really enjoying that. But I'm uh, gonna taste it. <laughs> it's actually really good. It's a real American milkshake with loads of chocolate and some whipped cream. And I'm actually curious what this thing is now. I think it's marzipan or something. Uh, most likely. No, it's meringue. Yeah, or at least I think it's meringue. But this is, um, it's actually really good. It's all American milkshake. They do advertise it that way too. Yeah, um, 10 euros though. I'm not quite sure I would like say 758 will make more sense. But I mean, it's a round price. It's better than all the merchandise here with 399 or you grab a bottle of water for 379. So yeah, even your water, if you want a water, water here, it's 4 euros. It's yeah. higher than when you go to the mass service. But again, I like the fact that it's sit down. That is great. You can sit outside with a sit down. Normally you sit inside. I think that's amazing. But um, and they do have some indoor seating as well. As you yeah, but for now. Get back I'm, down in there. But for now, I'm just gonna uh, finish my milkshake. So we see you guys later. Enjoy. Oh, I always love citron. Citron. Mm. So what's your verdict on the on the pastries? Yeah. Well, I'm a sucker for like a lemon tart. So I like the lemon. It's done very well with a creamy lemon curd. Chocolate's really good. And this one, the mint, you don't really taste the mint. I'm just, okay. Uh, but the bottom is nice. I don't know what they made it out of, but the bottom of the pastry is really nice. Uh, and yeah, you don't really taste mint, so it's a cake. A creamy cake, but it's good. I have the same opinion. For me, it's the, the citron one, then the chocolate one, and then the whatever it might be. It mint. has a cheesecake texture, though, with the green part. So. I don't like it. So, would you, would you recommend coming here? Yeah, it's a nice uh, difference than what, what you have at every single restaurant.